Crystal. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I'm going to be doing something a little fairly different. Um, here on my channel, I do fashion, beauty, as well as lifestyle videos. But today I am going to be talking to you guys as well as showing you my waist training journey. But before we get into the video, be sure to give me a beautiful thumbs up as well as subscribe. We will definitely love to have you a part of the crew. Okay, so now let's get into it. I purchased a waist trainer from Amazon and um, or originally I was trying to purchase the Lux Curve waist trainer. However, every time I went onto the website, unfortunately they did not have my size, so I settled for Amazon. This is actually what the waist trainer looks like. I got it probably in less than two days. Um, here is here's the waist trainer now I did a bit of research before I purchased this and um, the importance is these little hooks right here this is what makes a big difference I know at first you're supposed to um, or they recommend that you start with the first set of hooks and then after about a month or so you would then go to the second hooks and then the third hooks and what you want to do is you want to get a waist trainer that is not your size one size down so that it could encourage re-sculpting your body the difference between a waist trainer and a corset is waist trainers are very as you can see they're pretty like flexible a lot more pliable than a corset is corsets really can do a lot of damage um, and they have done a lot of damage over time. So the reason that I decided to waist train is for a couple of reasons. One, of course, I wanted to kind of like singe my waist as well as uh, for good core and as well as uh, alignment and stability. And uh, so those are the main reasons why I decided to waist train. So I definitely did make sure that I did my research. Um, so I decided to get this and I'm just going to, I'm gonna show you what the waist trainer looks like on. So I actually zoomed out the camera a bit so that you can actually see me wearing the waist trainer. So I'm just gonna stand up so i forgot to mention that waist trainers actually have little bones at the sides and that's what's going to help to re-sculpt your body also you want to make sure that when you are waist training that you do get them in a smaller size but not only a smaller size but once you place the waist trainer on your stomach is actually supposed to be smaller and that's what's really going to help to encourage and re-sculpt your body it's not supposed to be bigger than your stomach it's supposed to be smaller and also also, it makes a world of difference when you put on a waist trainer lying down as opposed to standing up. It makes such a difference. Now, I wear the waist trainer eight hours a day. I do not exceed eight hours a day. They do say that they don't recommend wearing it um, beyond the eight hours. Um, when I wear my waist trainer, I do make sure that I do wear something underneath it. Now, the first few days, I was not wearing anything underneath my waist trainer and I noticed that when I would remove it it would leave all of these dents in my skin and I definitely did not want that um, so I decided to just wear either a white tee or just any kind of cotton shirt underneath the waist trainer just to protect my body as well as to protect the waist trainer as well um, you know so it doesn't get uh, all sweaty and all that kind of stuff because we do perspire in the day especially in the summertime so they do say that after a month you will see results for me i actually started seeing results after two days of wearing the waist trainer which is quite amazing um i did notice that my stomach was a lot smaller and it's just it just looks a lot more cinched a lot tinier i did see quite a bit of difference within two days of me wearing the waist trainer now with waist trainers the results are not permanent so if i'm wearing a waist trainer let's say consistently for three months and i and i notice a tremendous difference and i lose about three inches off of my waist if i can if i no longer wear waist trainers my body is going to go back to the original form um, so they do recommend that you continue to wear waist trainers maybe not every day but at least once or twice a week after you see the results to just kind of maintain the results it's kind of similar to wearing so 
for me because I have a background in dental it reminds me of wearing a retainer so typically after somebody wears braces and they have amazingly beautiful teeth those teeth can shift back unfortunately to the original state of how the teeth was before um, somebody wore braces and that's why it is so crucial to wear a retainer after the braces just to kind of keep everything in its form because our bodies tend to want to revert back um so that's a great way that's the way i remember okay waist training i'm like yeah i've seen great results i want to maintain these results so i'm still going to have to waist train so yeah i definitely wanted the snatched waist and i just wanted to look i just wanted more of like a curvy look and that's why i decided to do it so i wasn't sure if i was going to see results i know i heard a lot of people say you know they see results within 24 hours and I wasn't sure so I definitely had to put this to the test and I really like it um, I'm definitely going to continue waist training it's something that I enjoy doing um, so I am going to continue to waist train I definitely love the results and um, I'm I am definitely going to update you um, within the first two months and three months and just to let you know the progress that I've made so thank you for tuning in. I will definitely document um, my journey in waist training. And so if you've ever waist trained or if you're thinking of waist training um, or if you have, I would love to know what the result is. I would love to know how you find waist training. I would love to know what you think of waist training. If you have any other helpful tips that I forgot to mention or maybe that I'm not aware of, definitely be sure to leave that in the comment section down below and have a beautiful day. Stay blessed.